Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are all having a fantabulous day. So, Pisces, before we get into this reading, as usual, I will be putting down some good old-fashioned holy water. The holiest of all the holy waters. So good in the neighborhood. Pisces. So, you know what time it is? Tarot's now in session. The most honorable judge, T.T. T. Don, presiding. You can all do whatever you want. So, we're going to check in on the energy of that person you're dealing with. Or, whatever energy could be potentially approaching you, like I always say. It could very well be your own energy. Whatever the case is, we will get it. We will hit it, and we will quit it together like we always do, baby. Yeah, yeah. Time is it? Okay, sorry, I had to look at the clock. Show me the energy the person my beautiful Pisces is dealing with. the energy the person not the beautiful Pisces is dealing with. Sure. Show me the energy the person not the beautiful Pisces is dealing with. Show me the energy the person not the beautiful Pisces is dealing with. <laughs> I got a shuffle, a shuffle. Okay. All right. Let me pull out my sword. We got the Fool, the Ace of Swords, Three of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, King of Swords. Looks like you definitely are going to be talking to somebody about something. Looks like they're. Want to take a risk here, or on the verge of it, possibly. I don't know. Which could be, be hesitant. This person here has been running from something. And uh, it looks like this person here, I don't know. They're wanting to work on something here. So, I think we just need to get into this reading. And see what your mother trucker has been running from here. So, what has this mother trucker been running from here? What have they been running from, please? What's this person been running from? Don't tell me the law. Justice comes out. They've been running from the law. <laughs> what have they been running with with the Queen of Pentacles? Like a jackrabbit. What have they been running from here? <laughs> What's this person been running from here with the Queen of Pentacles? Come on. They have been running from making a powerful decision here. Something that could turn this person's world upside down. But it's like there's a lot of unknown things. And that's what keeps this person running. Because they feel like there are some things that they don't know. Okay? Mm-hmm. And basically, they've been running from you. And because they're not really clear about everything. It's like... They see the glass as, like, it's half empty. And that that emptiness is a void. And that's what they are very unclear about. And they feel like this void could suck them in. Okay? That's kind of strongly what I'm picking up here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, boy. We got one of these mother truckers. Why can't we just go back to 
Kitty Boom Boom, Rainbow, Unicorn, Leprechaun, Leprechauns, and Pots of Gold at the end of the Rainbow readings. I would really like some of those. That would be just a huge blessing. But, unfortunately, it just doesn't work out like that all the time. Once in a while I get those kind of readings. I definitely appreciate it when I do get those kind of readings. Okay. So, what's this risk here? What are they on the verge of here with the Fool energy? What are they on the verge of with the Fool energy? What are they on the verge of with the Fool energy? What is this person on the verge of with the Fool energy? Hmm. <clears throat> What's the fool with the justice? Okay. Why am I getting that they actually... This is weird, too. This is weird. I feel like this person took uh, some kind of gamble here... And they landed themselves in jail. And maybe that's why they're not making a decision. Maybe they're physically in jail. Maybe they ran from you. And as they were running from you, they did something risky. Okay? And it landed them in jail. And maybe they ran from you because they were trying to avoid their making this decision here. And... Maybe just karma came back and bit them. But I'm getting jail. Mm-hmm. And if this is not jail, this person is like, nope, I'm not taking a risk. Okay? So, I don't know. It could be either two scenarios. Either they landed in jail, took a risk, or they're not going to come to you. Because it's like, nope, not taking a risk here. Because obviously, they're not making a decision here about you. Oh, brother. Okay, let's talk to the Three of Pentacles here. What's going on here with the Three of Pentacles? What's going on with the Three of Pentacles, please? What's going on here with the Three of Pentacles? Thank you. And if it is... Somebody may be having a hard time too walking away from you here. Alright. This person could really have a hard time walking away from you. But it's like... They're determined here. It's like this this isn't working here. My goodness. Why do I gotta get the I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Guys, help me out here. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, we're gonna talk to the ace of swords. There's the three of swords. Oh my god. I don't think I've ever pulled that in a reading. Yeah, I feel like maybe somebody just might just drop this all together. What's going on here with the ace of swords? Especially if they're in jail. I don't know. Ace of Swords, though. Let's talk to me. Okay. There's this fact gathering. There's this fact gathering energy that they're doing. Yeah. Fact gathering here with judgment. Uh, yeah. And it's almost like... Because you go judgment, okay, then you go to the world, and then it resets itself to the fool. So I feel like this Ace of Swords, this person is clear that they don't want to make a decision. They want to close this chapter, and they can't come towards you because they're in jail, or they just don't want anything to do with this situation. Sorry, it's not what you want to hear, okay? 
I'm not here to feed you what you want to hear. I'm here to read the energy, okay? Sorry if this person is a complete pendejo at the end of the day. But I definitely see somebody here that's like, yeah. I never made a decision. I'm making a decision now that I'm not making any decision and I'm not taking a risk either because they're just not or they just physically can't because they're in jail. Oh, brother Pisces, where's the unicorns at? Okay. I'm going to grab some final oracle messages here. We're going to use Janice's deck. Okay. You don't love me. Okay. Goodness. Come on. Okay. It's for the higher good. Okay. That's obvious. Yep. And pride keeps us apart. And for some reason, I'm drawn to I was disillusioned. Uh, or maybe I, they were just, they're disillusional. <laughs> That's probably more like it, right? <laughs> so... If it resonated, whatever you want to do, like, share, comment, subscribe, and I hope I'll see you later. Carol's adjourned.